Hello everyone and welcome to my new series called Effective Loadouts. Today we're going to be showing you the Windfield, the weapon that everyone can play with from the start, no matter what level. This weapon is really underrated in my opinion and is really good for the price and the level we unlock it at. So let's go into the advantages of this weapon straight away. Semi-automatic, you are very mobile with this we weapon and you don't need to reload every you know shot five shots two shots three shots whatever gun you're using right now but the disadvantages is it doesn't do that much damage in range and obviously the 70 meter headshot so anything over 70 meters you're not going to one shot headshot but that's fine because we're going to be showing you how to position well and how to use this weapon and also here's a loadout picture we have the windfield small slot silencer I went with the silencer because I'm playing solo so I don't really want to make too much noise you can substitute the small slot with anything else you want or prefer and the tools we have the knife first aid kit and alert mines the knife can also be substituted for dusters for example for the emulator and obviously first aid kit is a must every single loadout and the alert mines are for if you choose to go for the boss or you know setting up an ambush something like that and for consumables we're going for two vid shots and a flash bomb I like the flash bomb. You can also substitute the flash bomb for a nade. Nades are pretty good and they're not bad after the pitcher nerf. They're still very good. But I just go with the flash bomb because they're pretty funny to use. And obviously with the another trait that adds another consumable to it, you can go for a flash bomb and a nade or you can go for two flash bombs or you can go for two nades. It's totally up to you. So I'm going to show you some clips and highlights of me playing solo mostly. And then a few clips playing duos. Because most people do play duos. So I just wanted to add that in. So enjoy the video guys. And I'll see you at the end of the video. Enjoy. Light filters. Keep peace. Keep peace. Force fed, what's up, man? Okay, listen, I don't want to talk about my face here, okay?
Oh, fuck. So in this clip, GG, brother. he took the surprise factor to them, took one of their duos out, and the second guy had a Mosin. So we positioned very well within the 70 meter range, we just harassed him, and then as soon as he pushed us, we used the flash bombs and the wind field together, and it worked perfectly. I knew the first guy had a aftermath because I saw him earlier in this game. And then I knew this guy had a Mosin because I heard shots. So this is how you should position most of the time. And as you saw with the other clip, the first one we saw, exactly the same thing. Yes, we can see the scanner, okay? Alright. I couldn't help it.
Now here you see a shotgun charging at me. So we're gonna keep perfect range within 15 meters. There you go. Come on, what are you doing? Throw him to clue. to miss downstairs and... someone tower there yeah he's in the tower downstairs okay. right in front of you. Flash. 
headshot, headshot. He's not dead though. And here I see I'm getting pushed by an aftermath. I can't take that, so I go for the flash. It's going to burn, yeah. Aftermath. <laughs> nice. Shot the spider, so it's gonna take like five hours. Mm. If it is the spider, if it is the spider, this concertina as well. Yeah, I'm at 75 HP. I see him on the top. No, his friend's burning. Yep. We should have killed this guy. Fuck, I could have. Yeah, I missed all the pistols for me. Bones. Tier 3? Yep, it's on the right side. <laughs> Take your run around. Dead, yes. one dead, inside. Tier 3 is still in the other side. You can flash by the way. Can you flash? Yeah, already. No, you're all oh, You're already dead? Okay. Tier 3 is on my left. Can you come up and open the door? Yeah. And just unpeak. Just unpeak straight away. Careful for the doors left. Mm. Yep. He's on the stairs, I think. Careful for the grenade. I think he's gonna get flash here. Nope. I'm throwing. He can actually hit me with that. Oh, oh wow. Well. Again, I want to point out here that this person inside the spider building has a shotgun. So I'm keeping 15 to 20 meters range. Waiting for him to make a mistake. And hopefully we can get that headshot. Oh. <laughs> you can probably loot that guy maybe. Yeah, I'm checking if I can get a flash off of him. He's still there with a shotty. I got throwing moves. Really setting up the fourth or third. <laughs> I 
You can't push, you can't push. Oh, they constantly have all of the entrances, there's no way in. And the backs of the doors. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and learned something from it. Please like, comment and subscribe. And please let me know what kind of videos you want next and what loadouts you want to see in the second episode of this series. Have a great time. Dreams are real. Take care. Hey, what's up, dude?